matchup between Jorge Masvidal and Michael Bisping. One of the more accomplished strikers in this division. Sprawl and brawl, whatever you want to say, he's going to try to keep this fight standing tonight. It does not matter how he accomplishes it. All he wants to do is be on his feet and at range, hitting you with the beautiful jab, staying away from the grappling exchanges. You don't accomplish all the things that this man has accomplished over the course of his career without understanding distance. He has great distance management, which then in turn allows him to land all these beautiful diverse kicks, spinning back kick, jumping high kick, so many things he possesses that he will try to use tonight in his fight. Yeah, if this time... So here we go with round one, classic match. Oh, man. Massive head kick. Oh! All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. Whoa! And now he lands a combination. He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Oh! These guys throwing early. Oh, straight right. And just inches away from landing one of those big right hands. Kick there by Jorge Gamebred Masvidal. All right, so another swing and a miss. And I'd imagine if your gas tank is this low, you got to find times to try to preserve that energy and, and get yourself back to a place where you can actually dole out some damage. Yeah, you got to get out to space, find places to rest and recover. Get against the object, go to the clinch, find ways to just recover so that when you have that next explosion, it actually has some meaning to it. Bisping gets caught with that punch. Don't be afraid to get that. Oh, that's that's perfect. Perfect. Body shot there. He's unbelievable. That shot landed perfectly. And now he's got his opponent hurt. So just over 20 total strikes have found the mark for Jorge Game Red Masvidal. Look at the turtle in that kick. <laughs> oh, big roundhouse attempt just misses. You gotta check these low leg kicks. Back to the leg kick now. That one's no good. Now he's got the boy tosses him down. Now we'll see if he can advance position. I mean, right into side control. Working off of his back here. Looks like he may try to hip escape. Bisping's lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. Oh, look at him jumping in to try to get the finish. Pretty good work with the strikes here off of his back by Bisping. Recovery, man, right back to his feet. Straight punch lands. And that left hook landed on the button. Visibly limping here. Horn sounds for the end of round one. Okay, you ready? Round two. Ready? Let's go, fight. Sound defensively blocks the shot.
Masvidal's strike attempt there is blocked. Big strike lands. Big strike lands. Now he looks to try to chase down that finish. Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got a pressure. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Nice punch lands over the top. Back and forth we go! Slips the punch nicely there. Well, he has landed some good shots, DC, but really unable to string anything together in terms of solid combinations. It's because he's not committing to it fully. He throws his jab. He may throw the right hand out there, but he's not really sitting down on the right hand. He really... Huge strike lands there. Somehow, his opponent stayed up there. I mean, he's still on his feet, but he's not up by much. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Just out of range with the big right hand. Oh! oh, how good is that? The diving punch lands plus to the head. Back to the feet. Man, has he landed a high volume of strikes here in round two. Definitely picking up the pace after round one. So he got the message from the corner, and now he is taking control of this second round. Over and over, he landed his big body kicks. Well, for years, Tyron Woodley had said Jorge Masvidal is the best boxer on this UFC roster. Certainly showed you the hands there. DC. I mean, he's showing it, man. I mean, I mean, he's showing it, John. This guy has the ability to stand and box with anyone in the UFC. And that was... Oh, no, no. Yeah, there's another one for the highlight reel, and that's probably as good a knockout as he's had in the UFC. Just a perfect shot to end the fight. Crowd absolutely loving it. Flush land to close out his opponent. I'm not even sure the other fighters saw it coming, so a big knockout for him here tonight on the biggest of stages. Well, what a moment for him here tonight. A huge knockout on one of the sport's biggest stages. That is one they'll be talking about for some time. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mergliata has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 17 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout.